Hi, I'm Lady Teaspoon and it's been a year since I made a Zeros and Heroes video. The last time I had my best intention to make one every month, but that obviously didn't happen. But it's a new year and I'm ready to give this another shot. So let's get started and let's get the Zeros out of the way. I kind of feel bad putting this into the list because it's not a bad product. It just didn't work for me. So this is the Patisse Troy Shampoo in Coconut and Exotic Tropical. So the reason it is on the list is because it has a really, really strong smell. And I guess it is to be expected, but this came in a duo pack. It had like a volumizing dry shampoo and then this one. So I probably wouldn't have bought this um, on its own, but it was in the duo bag, so I was like, hey, let's give it a go, maybe I'll end up liking it, but no, it's a bit too, too strong for me, and it's like this really sweet, fruity, coconutty smell, and I'm not really into that. But hey, like, if you like fruity smells, maybe this is the perfect product for you, but if you're not into that or you're sensitive to smell, then I can't recommend this. Again, I kind of feel bad talking about these, but they didn't really do what they were supposed to, so I'm putting them on the list. These are Revolution's Velvet Lipsticks, and they came in the Salvation Lipstick Kit. I actually made a whole video about that, I will put the link right here. So, um, these were okay, but they were supposed to like dry matte and be touch proof, and I don't think that they really did that. And they don't really have that much pigment, but if you're really into like the no makeup makeup look, look and do like super nude makeup, then these would probably be great for that. But they are a bit too light for my taste. So that is for the zeros, let's move on to the heroes. This is a backpack by Eastpack. I actually got this at the start of my exchange, so a few months back, but I haven't talked about it before, so I decided to kind of throw it in here. So this one was a bit pricier, but I didn't have a backpack at the time, and I really wanted a bag that was good quality, so I feel like it's important to invest in a few pieces because this will hopefully last me like many years. I think it has like a 30 year warranty, so that is pretty cool. And also it has a pocket for your laptop. And it is quite big so you can fit like a lot of stuff in here. And I felt like this small pocket here was also really nice. I usually get like uh, painkillers and break mints and stuff like that here. So yeah, um, I have been using this quite a lot during my exchange and it still looks like really nice, like there aren't any stains here, the color is still really bright. So I do recommend, like if you are looking for a backpack, I recommend checking out East Bag. This one is Bright Story by Karomori. And I'm currently on volume 6. I actually started reading this series a while back, but I kind of fell in love with it again in January, and I don't think I have talked about it before, so I wanted an excuse to kind of talk about this amazing series. It basically tells the stories of different villages and families during the 19th century that lived along the Silk Road. And we follow this character, Amir, quite a lot, and she's a new bride, and she's kind of getting used to the new way of living. But we also get to see a few other villages and a few other families, which is pretty interesting. So if you haven't already read this, I definitely recommend it. Uh, even though it's, it's fiction, there is so much like detail and love put into it and put into the research. So it's a wonderful read. The next thing I want to talk about is Sims 4. I got it for a Christmas present and I have been like obsessed with it. I'm a huge Sims fan, I played Sims 1, Sims 2, Sims 3 and I think I have pretty much all of the expansion packs for like all of them. <laughs> and 
So now I have been kind of getting into Sims 4 and so far I am really liking it. Of course like with every new generation there are a few things that I'm not so sure about. I'm kind of getting used to them but it took me a while to get into Sims 3 so I feel like it will just kind of take time for me to kind of really get into Sims 4 but so far I am really liking it. Lately I have been really into wearing bright pink lipsticks and this one is Criminal by Makeup Academy and this one is by Revolution and I don't know if this one has a name but these two colors are quite similar and they are both liquid to matte lipsticks and they, I think they were both like three pounds each, so quite affordable. And I bought them when I was in UK. This is Super Drugs Clear Volume Dry Shampoo. And I actually have been using this for quite a few months. I actually just bought this one because it was like the cheapest volumizing dry shampoo and I actually ended up really liking it. So when I left UK, I went back to Super Truck and bought like two bottles with me because I have been trying out different brands but so far this one has been my favorite and I'm pretty sure I can't get it in Finland so we'll see what happens when those two puddles run out. I really like this one because it gives me nice volume and it also blends into my hair quite nicely. This necklace is also something I found in the UK. Here's a close-up of the necklace. I really like the fact that it kind of shimmers and changes its color when the light hits it. I bought this in Sheffield from a Sheffield company called Earth Ash and I will put the link down below for their web shop. And I really like this one because it has nice color and it is quite eye-catching but it's also kind of subtle and small. So it's very versatile and I can wear it with a lot of things. This amazing popcorn shirt is from Tate Modern and it's so soft and such good quality and it is pretty warm also which is perfect for winter and I love the print and I have been wearing this like everywhere all the time and I think this was, this was like 30 pounds. That is all for today. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I will see you next time. Bye!